hey lovebirds welcome back to another video so in today's video as y'all can tell by the title i will be doing duck nails this is my second time attempting to do duck nails and i am not good at doing french tips at all but like i say always i am a beginner nail tech okay some of these videos have just been sitting in my gallery y'all it's just been sitting there i ain't gonna sit here and lie this video is so old but we here okay here i am placing the nail tips on and y'all finna see this little clip where the nail is sitting on that little hand thing y'all that's what she get for being over there tip tapping them nails and the acrylic ain't even on watch look at that girl if you don't sit them fingers still So now I'm going in and I'm clipping her nails down. Oh, y'all, I don't know why these kids be testing me. They be wanting long nails. Like, baby, no, they don't even want me to clip half of the time. Child, if y'all don't get up out of here. But I am using the magnet method. Now I am going in and I'm trying to shape up the size, y'all. I think that's why I went wrong. I need to watch a few more videos. Um, but y'all can clearly see where I went wrong. I was shaving the size down as if I'm doing square tip nails. All right, y'all, on to the next step. Here I am blending the nail tip with the natural nail uh, without doing too much drilling onto the natural nail because I already did, you know, the pre-steps before putting the tips on. And I don't want to damage the client's nail or hurt her at that. All right, y'all, so I'm going in with my brush and just brushing away all that dust. All right, y'all, this is one step you don't want to miss. It is the primer and the hydrator. Please do not forget that part, y'all. And another thing, I clipped this part out because the fingers was not in the camera all the way. But I did cut off her cuticles, y'all. Please make sure you cut them cuticles off. It will help the nail stay on a lot longer. Now I'm going in with my acrylic. Um, I'm still learning to build my acrylic, y'all, and picking up my beads and everything correctly. So forgive me for the ones that are professionals and watching this and want to, you know, come at me. Just know I am trying here. And I think I, I've been doing pretty good on uh, knowing that I've been uh, doing it on my own, like just self-taught. So yeah, y'all, I'm just going to allow this part right here just to play. Um, I, I did kind of speed it up a little bit for you all. And yeah, don't forget to like this video, y'all. And comment down below what you guys would like to see from me. Like what kind of videos y'all would like to see from your girl. And I know I said I was going to leave y'all alone. I promise y'all I'm going to leave y'all alone. Okay, to just uh, applying the acrylic is done for but um i only did one hand on camera so y'all won't feel like y'all have to speed through thinking i was gonna do two hands I only did one hand on camera
all right y'all so this is her hands this is how it looks after i applied the acrylic now i'm just going to go in and clean the acrylic up like the shaping up uh i kind of not kind of i know i messed it up y'all i messed up the shape but it's okay i'm practicing she is one of my nail models boom look how it's looking it's a little duckish you know what i'm saying a little duckish now i'm gonna go in with the design y'all um like i said these videos have been sitting in my camera in my gallery for quite some time i think this was like a spring set um so this is around springtime but i promise y'all i'm gonna empty out my gallery now so y'all can start getting updated videos but yeah I don't um I haven't done French tip um a lot so y'all please do not come at me okay for these tips I'm trying
okay you guys so here is the finished look thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching your girl and i really do appreciate y'all don't forget to like comment and subscribe